Welcome to this edition of Video Drone by DIY3DTech.com. We're out here on the beach and there's some stuff going on out there in the lake. I was going to see if I can fly out there and check it out. So one of the things, I'm going to run the multiple panel antennas on the copter this time around and see what kind of distance. So I've got it all set up. Um, one thing I do want to, I want to set up here is I want to move this over and start screen recording. So I'm going to start screen recording. And start now. So I'm starting screen recording. I'm going to be using the DIY Go, DJI Go app. So we got everything set up on the copter. So we're going to set launch on the copter. And we're going to take the copter up a little bit. And we're going to let it get situated. We're going to do our typical walk around. Kind of do our inspection on it. Everything's looking good. So, uh, what we're going to do is point it out that way. And I want to kind of get situated my bearings. I'm going to start rec screen recording. Or, sorry, recording. So, I believe I got recording started. So I'm going to take it up, and I'm going to start heading out that way, and let's see how, how far we get out there. Uh, let's see how we're doing. We're heading uh, straight out for those ships out there. Let's see. I want to give it some air. And I want to hold up right about there. So I want to see if I can't uh, gimbal it around. They're moving up like pretty fast, so I don't know. I need to get out of the glare a little bit. This, uh, this tablet and the glare just seems to really be something else. So I seem to be out there about 1400 feet. Let's keep pushing it. So we're up around 1600 feet. We're out around 2,000 feet. Been a lot of glare on the tablet, so I think I'm headed out to that general direction. I'm gonna pan it out a little bit more. I'm out to 3,000. I tell you, this panel antenna is really, really working good. I'm really getting the range out of it. I'm almost at 4,000 feet. Still really good signal strength across 4,000 feet. Eighty-six percent battery. Closing on 5,000 feet. Really having a hard time seeing the screen. Basically, I'm full sticking it. I'm at about 60 feet. Ah, now I got to return to home at 5,300 feet. And I'm going to go ahead and let it return to home. So I made it out there about 1,500 or sorry, over 5,000 feet with the panel antenna. I think I could have probably pushed it a little bit more. Uh, I'm going to watch this thing coming home. I got a few people on the beach today. But uh, she's heading back in. I'm down to about 81%. So battery's hanging pretty good. They're out there a ways a lot further than I think I can really reach out to. 
And uh, one of the things I did too, but I, I'm not sure it really made a big difference, is I calibrated the gimbal today. Uh, you notice in a couple of the last videos I was mentioning I was having problems with the gimbal. So I calibrated it today, so I'm hoping... Uh, but it still looks kind of slanted in the video, so I'm really not understanding that. And yeah, let's see, we're coming in about three, we're at about 3,000 feet. We're down to about 77%. And I'm just kind of keeping an eye out for it. So it's gone to its return to home altitude of about 97 feet. About a thousand feet out, I think I'm going to try to stop it and bring it in manually. I'll see. Uh, so I'm coming in about 2,000 feet, so I still have has has a way to go. I'm going to bring it down a little bit so I can see it come in. I can see uh, the beach on the FPV video. Bringing it down. I want to get it down around 60 or so feet. So it should be coming in. Uh, yeah, here it is. There it is, return to home. It's coming down. I'm going to stop it before it hits the ground. Yeah, she's coming down. Coming down a little bit closer. I'm going to yaw back around. I'm going to hold it right about there and bring it down a little bit more, kind of do a walk around. So everything seems to be going good. I'm going to save out the video. So I think I got the video saved out. Uh, let's see, how does the battery look? I'm at 69. I, I still got some battery left in it, so I'm going to... Let's see, I'm about 13 feet. So I'm going to gimbal down a little bit. And do some straight out flying. And see how this does it. That yeah, parallax is getting me again because it sure looks like it's heading into the drink. So I'm going to bump it up a little bit. And bump it up a little bit. Bump it up. And I'm out there about a thousand feet. So I'm going to hold it around out there. And I'm going to bring it back in towards me. Uh, she's coming back in backwards. There it is. I can see it. I got line of sight on it. Boy, she's really moving today. Uh, bring it back a little bit towards me. We still got 62%, so I'm going to try another run. I'm going to bring it down. 
I'm gonna bring it over a little bit, over this way a little bit. And I'm gonna bring it down. Angle it. And I'm about 15 feet, so let's punch it out over the lake. Take it out again. And let's right raise it up a little bit. And we're taking it out there. And we're just hanging around out there. I've got it uh, about 27 feet off the deck. I'm going to yaw it around. A little bit of a delay in the yaw. I think my birds put, put me on where it's going to head back in my direction. So let's bring it back in. Here it comes back in. I got line of sight of it, which is good. So we got it coming back in now. Battery's dropping around 50%. So we're bringing her back in. Now let's bring her back in a little bit more. Uh, we got her backwards, so let's move her back over this way. We're videoing us. So let's do a whirl it around. Then let's bring it back over. Just checking the beach. Okay. So we're going to do another quick walk around just to make sure everything's good. You know, after those runs, I didn't have the video running. I'm going to do one more real quick. Because I've got the video running. I didn't have the darn video running. It's about 15 feet off the deck. We're going to head take her out there. Uh, the panels don't seem to work too bad directionally, so I wouldn't highly recommend them. Uh, again, if you're going to do, be doing a lot of uh, various flying around, but for, for something like this where I'm just kind of going out and everything's kind of happening in front of me, uh, they seem to be working pretty good. So let, let me bring this guy back in now. I'm getting down to about 40% on battery. So... Uh, I need to bring it back over by me a little bit. Okay. We'll bring it down. We're going to stop the... Uh, there, I think the recording stopped. Just checking the beach, making sure everything's clear. Bring it down. And, uh, yeah, we're at about 43%. I'm going to take, I'm going to stop screen recording here. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a grab capture and here we go so I'm not sure we'll have to take a look at the video if I made it actually made it out there to see what was going on with those ships um, getting made it out over 5,000 feet with the uh, panel antennas making sure I get this in there so again this are this uh, architect uh, modification really really just seems to be a super modification really really happy so uh, I can't recommend this enough. If you have a Phantom 3 standard, uh, to me, this is a must-have uh, addition. Uh, 
if you're going to be flying. So, anyways, hey, uh, give it a thumbs up, uh, like, and subscribe, and hey, we'll catch you in the next video. Cheers!